What's going on everybody, Jason here, uh, bringing you kind of a final update here on the 33 gallon long with the peacocks. I now have 14 peacocks in here. Uh, just last Friday after work, I picked up five at one PetSmart, drove to another PetSmart, picked up five more. I had 10 as of that Friday. And then yesterday, Saturday morning, went to another PetSmart, a third one. And that one, I didn't think they had cichlids, but they did, so I picked up three more peacocks because they were really colorful. Then I found out one of my local fish stores had electric blue uh, peacocks, so I picked up one of those. So then that's 14, and there it is right there. That's the electric blue. Now I don't know if that's a, a blue ollie. I asked them, they weren't sure, but they had probably had, gosh, I don't know, at least 10, maybe 15 of those in a tank, and they had them labeled as electric blue peacocks. Now his color is not obviously pronounced. Uh, he's only been in the tank for a day, so give him time for that that nice blue electric blue color to come back out But I am in love with this tank in love with these fish. This is so cool um, Really hasn't been too much aggression at all. Uh, they just kind of swim around There's been a couple chasing each other a little bit here and there, but nobody actually trying to kill each other But again, they're small that could change they're gonna get bigger and probably get a little bit more territorial, but uh, also Changing over, removing the black gravel that I had in there and putting it in the sand made the tank a lot brighter with the lights, almost too bright. I actually had to put duct tape over the LED lights in the canopy. The canopy has two lights. I had to put duct tape over a third of the lights on each one to bring the light down, but uh, it worked. But it's still, as you can see, it's still bright with like a third of all the lights being blocked out by duct tape. But I do know that that, one's a, that giraffe look at one's a Vanestas. I had one about 10 or 12 years ago. I do know they get bit big. The one I had was about, oh my gosh, 7 to 8 inches. And uh, they will grow big. But the plan is uh, this summer I'm going to be getting a 75 gallon and move these fish into that. And then we're going to move my wife's 20 gallon salt water into this 33 gallon and expand that salt water tank a little bit more. So. Uh, more videos to come, but these fish are, the colors are starting to pop after a couple of days. Here's them eating, uh, swarming around, just gobbling up that food. Um, I don't know the names of all these guys like I said in the last video. I know the electric blue, there's a strawberry one that's almost all orange. I think you can see them right there, the upper right, middle right. It's kind of hard to zoom. And then there's the Vanestas. The other ones I don't really know because PetSmart labels them as assorted peacocks. They don't really have their, I guess, their street name or their scientific name. So, but yeah, these guys are freaking amazing. I'm, I'm very glad that I went with the peacocks. They do seem less aggressive than the Ambunas or even American cichlids. They're not like convicts swimming around trying to kill each other. Really, really happy with these guys. I, I, I just, you know, what more can I say about this? Uh, so this, that's the video, guys. Uh, just showing them all. I got 14 there and a 33 gallon. I'll do an update here in about a week or two. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for all your help. Uh, if you're new, click to subscribe, like the video, stay tuned for more videos. And hey, feel free. Let me know what you guys think about this tank. If you guys have any comments or advice, leave them in the comment section of the video. And uh, stay tuned for the update in about a week or two. See you guys.